Hey guys, it's New York Prime, it's your Cup of King. Welcome to my latest video. This video is a Smash or Pass and it focuses on the next lot of characters in the uh, Smash or Pass of what's Winter Wonderland. Uh, so I hope you enjoy this. If you do, please like, comment and subscribe. Please keep in mind, I'm only messing around. Please don't take this seriously. If you enjoy this though, please like, comment and subscribe. And then on, on with the main video. So this is this week's reward for the challenges. It's a gingerbread Anna. And it's boring and dull. I don't like it. It's pretty much the same as a normal look. But they changed, changed it to have an apron and a few Christmas colours. It's boring and dull. Will I smash Anna anyway? No. She's too old. But I guess it depends if I'm in the right mood. <laughs> what my mood is so, but it's a pass for me Bastion again you know my rules no robots so there's a definite pass but I do like the different head which is totally different to all the others and I do like the fact that the bird's been changed to an owl and I love the fact that he has a hat and the hat's on all his different forms I love that but I can't have any fun with a robot so, it's a definite pass from me. Sorry, Bastian. I love Scrooge, um, McCree as Scrooge. He looks great, and it looks way better than a normal epic. It looks as good as his Mountain Man legendary, in my opinion. I love the glasses. I love the stubble. Mm -hmm. I even love all the snow on the costume. And the hat looks different. There's enough touches to make this legendary good. But would I smash him? It's McCree, so yes. <laughs> it's just McCree looking a bit older mm. and a little bit more cranky. But it's still McCree, so yeah, I'd definitely smash him. If this was a break the skin, Mercy Snow Angel would only get like a low rating of a 3 or a 4. It's a recolor with subtle differences. But in the smash or pass, she gets a definite smash because it's Mercy. Mercy always looks great. And I do love the white and the blue. It works well. But it's just a recolor. <laughs> and the fact that it's Mercy means she definitely gets a smash. As well as no robots, the other thing that's a definite no-no is animals. And uh, Roadhog with his walrus fisherman outfit, no. That mask is horrible, yuck! <laughs> and the fact that he's got all these dead bodies of fish, all the bones, all the rotten fish, no way! Definite pass! Yuck! Definitely not my type. <laughs> well, this definitely isn't an animal. I love the skin. It's great, the great skin, the mask looks great, and the colours, but Birdog's not my type, and that mask is a little bit too scary for me, so it's still a pass. Sorry, Birdog. Hope I wasn't a bit too cold. Let's <laughs> see what I did there um, for Birdog. Sorry, Birdog. I love this Birdog skin. If it was a rape skin, it would get a high marking, but it's not. Would I smash Birdog dressed like this? It's not an animal, and it's not a scary snowman. But Birdo's just not my type, so it's a definite pass from me. Again, sorry Birdo. Shiver is another amazing epic. I love this epic. I love the imprint of the snowflakes on his coat. I love the uh, sort of steam coming off from his uh, knees and his face. I love the effects. I love the colours. It's a great skin. And it's Reaper, so it's definitely getting a smash from me. Because underneath there, it's still Reaper. <laughs> so it's a definite smash. Again, if this was a uh, break the skin, this would get a terrible score. Because it's just a recolor with a new visor and hat. Boring and dull. But in a smash and pass, he still gets a smash. Because it's Lucio. And he still looks good. So, it's a smash. Sorry to interrupt the video, but I just wanted to say, if you're enjoying this, then please like the video. It really does help. It might not seem like it, but it does help a lot. 
I would greatly appreciate it if you did like this video. If you liked it, click the like button. Thank you. Now on to the video. Again, this would get a low rating if it was a RTS rated skin because it's just a bit boring. But in a smash of bass, it gets a smash because you can always remove all the layers and then you've still got soldier and soldier is still sexy so soldier gets a smash from me this sombra skin is simply a recolor it's boring it's just different colors that's all it is yes it does look more christmasy that's about it but this is a smash or pass and sombra always looks good and it's always sexy so of course he's getting a smash. Do you agree or disagree? Let me know in the comments. Unlike Sombra's epic, which was boring and dull, Rhyme is nothing but that. It's so good. I love this skin. I love the colours. I love the blue skin. I love the white hair. I love the ears. I love the spikes. I love the uh, particle effects. It looks great and she looks great. I would definitely give her a smash, though it might be a bit spiky and a bit cold. That's the only issue I've got, but I still would smash her. Do you agree or disagree? Let me know in the comments. Figure skating uh, smasher looks great. I love the lace. I love how see-through it is. You can see her legs and you can see her bum. <laughs> and it's one of her more elegant looks. I really do like this. And of course, she's getting a smash. She looks great. She looks so beautiful. Of course she's getting a smash. I absolutely love the new Lumberjack Torbjorn. He looks so sexy. He's a perfect fit for a, a Lumberjack. Normally he's a blacksmith. And a blacksmith and Lumberjack go hand to hand and works really well. I love all the little touches of the uh, woodcutter and a Lumberjack idea. It shows through. I love it. And I just love the colours and the textures. This is an amazing skin. And Torb looks sexy as hell. So yes, he's getting a smash from me. Though not as good as the Lumberjack. I really do love this uh, Santa Claus costume for Torbjorn. He looks great as Santa Claus. He, I just lo uh, love his hair. I love the beard, the way it's designed. I love the textures. I love the colours. It's great. And you know what? He looks so good with the white beard. Of course he's getting a smash from me. Jingle is a pretty simple legendary skin. It should be an epic. It would be good na nowadays. But it's a legendary. And you know what? I actually think she looks very, very cute. I like the hat and I like the colours. It works with her. She looks very cute and she's getting a smash. Widow's buffalo skin is definitely very cool i like it a lot it's a sporting widow maker that is hot in itself widow maker looks great and now she's in the sporty costume so yeah she's definitely getting a smash if you agree let me know in the comments to be fair i don't think there's a single way that widow maker could be a pass every look she has is very smashable i know i have a new animal rule but you know what, there's something about Winston's Yeti look that I really like. Maybe I have a thing for silver foxes. Because <laughs> I actually really do like this skin. And I reckon it suits Winston great. And I would smash him. Even with the giant skull on his back. <laughs> I absolutely love Reinhardt's conductor skin. The idea of combining a conductor with the train for Reinhardt is amazing. And he looks so cool. I love the monocle. I love the hat and I love the elements of the train. So as a rate the skin, it'd get a really good uh, rating, it'd get a 10 out of 10. As a smash, he still gets a 10 out of 10. Because yeah, you can take off the armor and he looks great underneath. Again, it's a silver fox. <laughs> but I reckon he looks great and very smashable. Of course, Reinhardt's legendary looks great. But it's epic, it still looks good. I like the colours, the gold works really well. I love the red and the green, but it is just a recolor with a, just a ribbon added to him and bells. 
So I guess we can see we've got bells and whistles. <laughs> Wait, no. This is the bells and the conductor is the whistle. <laughs> oh, sorry. That was terrible. But, yeah. Oh, it, it, he's still the silver-haired fox. And he looks great here. Even without the monocle, I would still definitely give him a smash. And as well, with Reinhardt, he's known for being in charge, where he charges into things. So at least you got that going for him. <laughs> Sorry, I might not be my type. You know what? She was very cute. I love the hat. And she would keep you nice and warm. So you know what? Zarya gets a smash from me. I'll start off by saying again, Zarya isn't my type. But the frosted look kind of works for her. I love the white and the blue. It works really well. And the pink frosted hair works really well on her. I'll definitely give her a smash. Do you agree or disagree? Let me know in the comments. This is another one that if it was a rated skin would get a 10 out of 10. I love it. It's a great design. Very retro toy. It looks great. I love all the touches and the batteries in the back. Even the uh, card with the holes in. It's got a lot of little details which make it a great skin. But it's a robot. I don't do robots. I don't touch robots. So I wouldn't smash a robot. So I'm sorry this is a pass from me. I'll be honest, not, uh, not uh, I can't talk. I'll be honest, nutcrackers are not my thing. I'm terrified of them. They're always so scary. That mouth and the eyes and no, just too scary. So even if it was just that, it'd be a pass. But the fact is a robot guarantees that Sinatra's nutcracker only gets a pass from me. Sorry, even though it's a great skin. So I hope you enjoyed this final look at the rest of the characters in Overwatch Winter Wonderland. If you have then please like, comment and subscribe. There are many more Overwatch videos and a few more Smash uh, and Pass videos. But I'm doing more of them with more events coming along. So if you like this there's bound to be something else you like. So I'll see you in the next video guys. Bye for now. And if you if this you see this at Christmas, I hope you have a great Christmas. Have a great new year.